guys i'm excited to start sewing dress for kids let's start sewing place bodies and lining right side together arrange the cut part to the upper panel to avoid confusion with the partner because the design of the front bodies is double breasted So the shoulder of the front and back garment as well as the lining with one half allowance guys done sewing the shoulder now after sewing the shoulder the next thing to do is to attach the strip to the waistline of the back and front bodies to attach the strip Measure 1 inch from the hem of upper bodies and mark. From the marking point, place the strip with 1 fourth allowance. Now guys, done sewing the strip. fabric to be used in making pleats for the neckline. This is the accent for the upper bodies. Now guys, done sewing the pleated ruffle. Place the right panel to the left panel following the notch and mark the center of the neckline. Now guys, place the pleated ruffles to the left panel. On the right panel, place the pleated ruffles from the back to the front neckline. Touch and sew the pleats to the neckline. Sew the pleated ruffles with one fourth allowance. Now, guys, we are done sewing the pleated ruffles. Now, Place the lining at the top of the outer part and sew the neckline with one fold allowance. Make sure shoulder seam stay open. Guys, we're done! Facing to the wrong side, we cut the edge seam of neckline. This will reduce the bulk of the seam and prevent from a ridge from forming on the outside of the garment. Understitch the lining away from the main fabric will be stitching 116 away from the neckline seam and the lining fabric. Sew the center back with one fold allowance. Guys, we are done top stitching the edge of lining and closing the center back of upper bodies. Sew the strap with one fold allowance, but provide an open part. Reverse the strap. Now 
now after sewing reverse the strap align the strap to the back strip Now guys, we're done attaching the strap to the back part. Guys, take the sides of outer part, the back and front, and sew with one half allowance. Do the same for lining. Guys, always use this technique to make the seam clean. All the seams for the back and front side should be inside together. Now guys, align the shoulder seam and side seam. So one fourth around the armhole. So the hem with one fourth and now one. Guys, done sewing the armhole and hem. Next operation, attach the bias to the armhole. done attaching and sewing the bias around the armhole. Next guys, prepare the back skirt. Together the lining, measure from the top of fabric down 3 inches. Then from the edge of the pattern, measure 1 inch and draw a straight line. Cut the fabric following the line. From the corner, clip 1 fourth inch. Now guys, Follow the cutting point, so the center back with one fold allowance. Do the same to the outer part. Now guys, we are done sewing the center back. Attach the outer part of the back skirt facing to the lining with the wrong and right side together. So the placket with one fold allowance. Guys, done sewing the placket. Now guys, reverse the outer part facing to the right side. Now guys, insert the seam and top stitch the placket. Are done. Top stitching the placket. At the 
center of the back part, measure 1 and 1 half inches, then fold the fabric facing to the right. For the second pleats, measure 3 inches, then fold the fabric facing to the left. Repeat the steps for the third and fourth fold. For the lining, make two rows of stitches. Guys, to create pleats for the front part, Follow the same pattern from the back part. For the front lining, do the same for the back part. Make two rows of stitches. Now guys, pull the top thread of the lining to create wrinkles or gathers. Take note guys, the waistline of the lining should be the same length to the outer part. After making gathers, sew the sides of the skirt with one half allowance. Guys, done sewing the sides. Align the side seams of the skirt and lining. Shout out to Miss Biel and Manilin Sabi. Maraming salamat po sa inyo. Now guys, match the notch from the left panel to the right panel. Sa mga nanonood ng aking videos, thank you so much. So guys, done sewing the upper bodies. Now guys, place the skirt on top, right sides together, and pin into place along the waistline matching side seam. Make sure you keep your body lining out of the way. Guys, don't forget to subscribe my channel and click the notification bell para updated po kayo sa aking mga video. Thank you! If you have decided to fully line the dress or the pleat dress, repeat the last step to join the bodice lining and the skirt lining together. Next guys, sew the bottom of the skirt and lining with one half allowance. Now guys, double check all the seams. Make your work clean. Ito na guys. Ngayon, ano masasabi nyo sa pinaghirapan natin? O ba? Sulit na sulit lang. Pleated with shearings po sa may ilalim. Okay. So, tamang-tama pong pangregalo ito, lalo na malapit na ang Pasko. Napakadali lang gawin. Mahirap lang siya tingnan, pero pag trinining nyo, kayang-kaya. Oh guys, eto na ang pinaghirapan natin gawin. Kung titignan ang design, akmang-akma sa nalalapit na Pasko. Tsak, magugustuhan ng mga anak ninyo. Kaya ngayon pa lang, try nyo na gawin ang katulad nito.